Hi, my name is Professor Paul Baines. I'm Professor of Political Marketing here at Cranfield School of Management. And I'm here with Dr. Taz Rajwani, who's Senior Lecturer in Strategic Management, also at Cranfield School of Management. And we're here to introduce the Government Affairs Research Club. Taz, what is the Government Affairs Research Club? So, Paul, the Government Affairs Research Club is a unique club. Not many in the country, actually. We, we, we kind of claim to be the most unique uh, evidence-based research club in terms of exploring government affairs, understanding the different best practices in government affairs, and understanding how does government affairs fit within the organization in terms of the strategy process and how it's developed. So what we focus on is researching government affairs directors and looking at how do CEOs, CFOs, different types of managers work closely with government affairs directors or government affairs uh, executives and our goal in the club is to allow people to network, learn from each other, learn from us, the faculty, especially because we're working very closely with Open University and Open University is a very distinct institution that has uh, academics that are really exploring this phenomenon of government affairs. So hopefully the, the research club will allow people to better understand those best practices. So who becomes a, a member of, of the Government Affairs Research Club? So who becomes a member is typically, typically some sort of government affairs specialist, uh, somebody who has expertise in government affairs, somebody who is constantly being challenged by government affairs or p the political arena or the social arena, people that are understanding how to deal with environmental issues, uh, with social issues. So we're trying to explore the external environment and a typical delegate that will come onto this club uh, will be somebody who is constantly being challenged by those issues. And uh, in terms of the nature of the offer, what would they expect to get from their membership? So in terms of the benefits, what, what I see them getting is basically an opportunity to learn from not only us, the faculty, who have extensive research experience in looking at how do governments work closely with business. So our goal will be to allow these executives to appreciate uh, how those best practices unfold in different industries, where they can learn from each other, network with each other, innovate their strategic thinking, but also to uh, better manage complexity in these environments. What do you think are some of the key issues in lobbying, public affairs, government relations at the moment? What, what do you think uh, is concerning this group of people, Taz? So, Paul, I think this is one of the biggest challenges that most companies are actually facing right now, whether it's how do they better manage uh, different regulations, legislations, how do they engage with political actors in the right way, in a responsible way. And our goal in a club is to unbundle this quagmire, understand how do companies better manage this risk, uh, how do they exploit some of the opportunities, how do they better manage their strengths in terms of capabilities and resources, how do they better manage those weaknesses within their organizations when it comes to managing government affairs. So I, I genuinely believe the big challenges at the moment are in companies that are looking abroad, entering new markets, companies that are currently dealing with the EU. And I think there are lots of codes of practice being introduced and there needs to be transparency and accountability. And our goal as academics is to make that clear and to help companies navigate this very difficult uh, environment. If I were, um, were a company grappling with some of these issues, why might I want to join a club like this and what would, what would the cost be? So the, 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 there is going to be a, a fee uh, which is on the website and what they would get out of it is lots of opportunities to better manage risk and to better understand what are the implications of doing something you know, in terms of uh, a strategic response. And our goal is to help companies understand what is their situation, what are their challenges, and how to best deal with them in, in terms of process and capabilities and resources. And our research, as you know, is very much embedded in this area. We've written lots of books together, and I hope 
what we'll give these delegates is a real practice orientated input where they will get not only learning, teaching, but they'll get lots of best practices from other industries. And, and I think the networking part is going to be vital to creating that experience. So there you have it. The Government Affairs Research Club is a new uh, research club, a unique concept at Cranfield, which brings together business, uh, uh, people in business, interested in a specific area, and uh, high-level academics, senior academics, working on uh, problems in the same area. So it's partly a networking club, partly a research club, and of course partly an events uh, organisation because the idea is that we bring together senior speakers in the field. Um, look out for us, we're on the website uh, searching Google on Government Affairs Research Club, Cranfield University. I hope to see you soon. Thanks very much. Bye.